every program at Universities of Applied Sciences have a set number of goals that are to be achieved by students to receive their diplomas. These goals are expressed in every program's national profile. Every educational unit within your program, whether it be a project, a course, traineeship, or anything at all for which students receive credits, should contribute to their achieving the final goals, outcomes, terms, or competencies of the study program. For you as a lecturer, this means that you need to establish exactly what place your educational unit has in the buildup towards achieving all of the goals described in your program's national profile. You are part of a larger system that will lead students towards receiving a bachelor or master's degree at BUAS. Be aware that programs use different words for these goals or outcomes. This means that you might see terms such as 21st century skills, Dublin descriptors, alongside terms such as competencies, final terms, and national outcomes. In Dutch, you might see competencies, eindqualificaties, or eindtermen. Don't let this confuse you. Within the HCTL, the Hague Center for Teaching and Learning training courses, we usually use the terms outcomes or competencies. This doesn't mean that students can't participate in enriching and inspiring activities alongside their mandatory educational units. The national profiles are set up as a framework that allows students to receive a diploma that is comparable to other ones within the Netherlands. It also keeps the program on course and aligned with what experts see as important learning outcomes for new professionals entering the job market. If you go to the Vereniging Holeskole website and click on Profilenbank, you'll find an overview of all programs that are taught at Universities of Applied Sciences in the Netherlands and their national profiles. It is good for you to be aware that different programs may use different jargon for their outcomes, but for now, you can simply focus on the way experts in your field have formulated the learning outcomes for your program alone. I invite you to find your program, download the profile, and get reading. Even though it appears in Dutch on this website, it is likely that the document was translated when the international variant of your program was developed. You can check with your department for a translation if you don't find one on the website. Once you've read the national profile, check whether there is any pre-existing information on the place of your own educational unit within the national profile. This could be found in a study guide. You could also check into your program's OLP. The OLP, which means Educational Learning Plan or Onderwijslehrplan in Dutch, should also provide you with this information. Make sure that the information about your unit is still current and correct.